this is Maya and Brandon. Today, we will be talking about alcohol dehydrogenase, its functions, structures, mechanisms, locations, and importance. Alcohol dehydrogenase is an enzyme expressed primarily in the human liver, although it can also be found in very small amounts in the stomach and lungs. Alcohol dehydrogenase is important because it enables humans to drink alcohol without lethal consequences. The initial purpose of alcohol dehydrogenase was to convert the alcohol produced by bacteria in the gut to non-toxic metabolic products. Today, its main function is to catalyze the oxidation of primary and secondary alcohols to aldehydes and ketones. The alcohol that alcohol dehydrogenase catalyzes is mainly the ethanol from alcoholic beverages. Eliminating ethanol from blood is crucial. However, the purpose of alcohol dehydrogenase is only to convert ethanol to acetaldehyde an even more toxic molecule. Therefore, the product of alcohol dehydrogenase catalysis must be quickly converted to other molecules that are easily utilized by human cells. Inability to metabolize ethanol or the underexpression of alcohol dehydrogenase has a negative effect on the function of the nervous system. On the other hand, Overexpression of ADH leads to a condition called alcohol flush effect. Alcohol flush effect is when one's face, neck, and shoulders quickly turn red after consuming alcoholic beverages. 80% of Asian people have a gene mutation that leads to the overexpression of ADH and causes this effect. Let's show an example. This is my our Asian friend. If my were to undergo a reaction with ethanol, the results would look something like this. Observe the reaction on her face. This is due to a higher rate of converting alcohol to acetaldehyde. The high concentration of toxic acetaldehyde causes a flush effect. This condition has been linked to a higher risk of esophageal cancer. This is a picture of alcohol dehydrogenase. Alcohol dehydrogenase is a protein with two subunits. Each subunit has a molecular weight of 40 kilodaltons. This adds up to a total of 80 kilodaltons. Each monomer has 72 residues. The active site in alcohol dehydrogenase is activated when its zinc 2 plus ion binds with two sulfur atoms from cysteine 46 and cysteine 172 and one nitrogen atom from histidine 67. Next, we will be talking about the mechanism of alcohol dehydrogenase. Ethanol will be used as the substrate in this example However, any alcohol can be used as the substrate. Ethanol binds to zinc at the active site of alcohol dehydrogenase. This causes the oxygen on the OH group of the ethanol to become more stable, leading to the hydrogen on the OH group becoming more acidic. While this is happening, the His-51 residue takes the H from the water molecule, forming a reactive hydroxide. This reactive hydroxide takes the acidic H and becomes a water molecule again. After that happens, there is a hydride shift 
from the carbonyl group to NAD+, resulting in the formation of NADH. Lastly, the product is released from the active site, forming an aldehyde. Once the aldehyde is released, the active site is regenerated. We hope the video was informative. Bye!